Hello and welcome to Consecration Corner, quite possibly the most powerful minute or two of your entire day. I'm Pastor Jay, and my wife is still my girlfriend. This is the fifth day of our 21-day consecration, and I want to focus our attention on Psalm 119. When you get a chance, read it all the way through. In the psalm, David's extended comments on the power of God's word details how important it is for us to make the word of God the most essential driving force in our lives. Too often, we rely more on our own instincts, experiences, and feelings to govern our course rather than God's word. But if we hide God's word in our heart, allow that word to order our steps and establish our short and long-term direction, God trusts us with the strength and wisdom necessary to be victorious. So here's what I want you to put into practice today. Find a verse from Psalm 119 that really speaks to you. Repeat it over and over again until you commit it to memory. And praise God for giving your spirit new strength. Let's pray. And Father, I thank you and I give you glory in the name of Jesus Christ for your word. For it is a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our pathway. We thank you, Lord God, that at the entrance of your word, there is life. I pray now, Father God, for illumination that comes from your word, direction that comes from your word, clarity that comes from your word. For it's your word that we hide in our heart that keeps us from sinning against you. We thank you and we give you praise in Jesus' name. Amen. Stay diligent, stay dedicated, stay disciplined. I'm Pastor Jay and you've been in the Consecration Corner. See you next time.